Hey all brothers and sisters, my name is Captain Meatshield and welcome back to Soma. Well, we've got our new power suit. We're, we're loaded into it and... Yeah, I'm still feeling a bit strange after the events of the last episode. It was very, very interesting to, to sit around and discuss things about. Um, but we need, to, we need to go and access the climber. I'm not sure... If this is it... Oh god. That, that just goes down. <sighs> okay, maybe we need the other platform. That looks like it's kind of got something stuck to it. Or stuck underneath it, so... Maybe that's what we're looking for. We need to start heading down into the abyss. We need to say farewell to Omicron. And see what lies in wait for us down in the dark old depths. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not entirely sure. I'm look, looking forward to it. Um, but who knows? May, maybe we'll be able to find some some answers down this way, which would be nice. Oh, oh. Oh, why, why are we going to be glitchy? Oh, hi. How's it going? You alright? Um, we need to plug Catherine in, I'm assuming. Are we done here? Yeah. Activate the climber, please. Sure thing. Okay. That, okay, that got it. Um, descent. Passengers one. Yeah, is that got it now? All right, there we go. Oh. Uh, okay. Let's strap myself in. Yep. Okay. Okay. Have we figured out what happens when we die? Is that even possible? Is there some kind of afterlife? Do you think my place is taken? The real me died like a hundred years ago. Is there still room for me? And what about the Simon I killed at Omicron? What do you think, Catherine? Is there a heaven full of redundant copies of the same people? There's someone up there who call me an imposter. It's dumb luck, right? And I woke up in the right body. I basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away at Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? You didn't hit the make sure Simon wakes up in the right body switch, did you? Not that you would know. I mean, he would still claim to be the right Simon. Christ. This is awful. We did an awful fucking thing. And you wouldn't mind. Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? Let me say something. I don't want to think. Ooh. Please. I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I can still feel how I had to, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair and the sun was setting and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. 
I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the Ark, would it be any different? I'd still be alone. No friends. No family. You could make new friends? I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler. If not, you still have... Oh god. Whoa. Whoa. Like this. Oh. Oh, what the hell? Um. Oh, I think I got to get out up here, am I? Yeah. Well, I feel like something's broken and I gotta fix it. Uh, that seems about right. Hey, I know it's not oh, much. There we go. Why are we stop moving? The power blacked out for a moment. I think it could be the atmospheric pressure. It's pushing pretty hard, really testing the limits of my suit. Don't worry, it should hold. Well, I hope so. It will hold. Does, does time freeze when you're not powerful? Time feels omitted more than anything. What's the difference? I don't feel like I'm being held back mm. or hindered. Okay. And I don't have the opportunity to reflect on the time I'm missing. It's simply missing. Sounds like sleeping without the dreaming. Yes. But generally you anticipate when you're about to sleep, and there's a natural continuation since we tend to wake up where we went to sleep. My experience sure. is more like an ever-changing moment that never really seems to find closure. Sounds kind of like a movie being edited live. I suppose so. I guess it sounds exciting, but it really keeps me activated to the point of exhaustion. <sighs> it's rough. Could be worse. Could be a time traveler stuck in a body made from black goo. That's true. Be the worst. <laughs> oh, it's getting a bit hazy. This far down. Jeez. What? Oh. Oh God. Oh no. Um. What the? Oh fuck! What are you? No! 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 Go away! You did it! You did it! Ross. Okay. But why? W what preparations do you need to make? Is there going to be cake? Uh, okay. Oh, good, you're back. Just about. Something dropped onto the cage. Knocks you right out. Spoke to me. Looks like a man, one of WoW's creatures. It just stared at you for a moment, then threw itself down the abyss. Mm. It said it would make preparations. I don't like the sound of that. It was very strange. I thought it was going to kill you for sure. I'm glad it didn't. Yeah, me too. Yeah, me three. Looks like we're closing in on the ocean floor. Good, not sure the climber could take it much longer. Okay, so this is the Omega Sector. It's about an acre of the abyssal plan used by Pathos 2. I expect we'll have to do some walking before we reach town. 
You haven't been here before? Not in a way that'll help us. I the other you has been here. We're following in your old footsteps, Ooh. Kat. When I had footsteps. You could still be down here somewhere. Technically. Don't remind me. Freaks me out. <laughs> Alright, let's head for tower and find that arc. Okay. Hmm. Definitely gonna want the flashlight, God. There is goop everywhere, and yeah, just looking anywhere else, it's pitch black. Blue link needed to call climber. Hmm. The fuck? Like, I don't know if things are so hazy because of the depth we're at, or if I'm actually injured. But, danger, area unsafe, stay close to lights. Okay. I will stay close to the lights. What the fuck is that? What the fuck's in here? Doesn't look like anything of interest. There's an audio buffer though, a data buffer. Tao? Come in, Tao. Please answer, Tao. Nothing. It's dead. Let's move out. We'll try the next one. Is that the. the ARC team? I'm assuming it must have been. Seriously, what are those noises? Is there anything in here worth looking at? Oh, audio down here is thick. I mean, that sounds like thunder. What happens if I pull this? I'm not entirely sure I want to pull it. Console here, what are you? Fault line activity. So those are the noises that we're hearing. Oh, that's going to be fun, isn't it? Gonna end up dealing with uh, seismic activity. Ooh, ooh, whoa, okay, you're in bits. Jesus, did you see that? Stick to the lamplights, they won't go near them. I can't, Valglasser. It's important I reach Omicron. Our future depends on it. Calm down. Let's just follow the path. If I die, I need you to tell Julia Dahl that the WoW is out of control. She needs to get to Sarang. He'll know what to do. Raz, you can tell him yourself. We just need to pick up the pace, okay? Glass! We lost the path! We need to go back! I know where to go. Come on! It's over there! The light is over there! Final push, Ross. Almost there, we just... Okay, so... Glasser, or Glasser, got... Got. So he was part of the team from Tau that was assisting Ross in getting to the climber. It seems. And the light stops here. Stay close to the lights. Blue leads to tell, red leads to the climber. Uh, 
Oh. Okay. Mm. Why am I expecting these lights to fail on me? Fucking hell is that thing? Those must be the things that won't go near the lights. Oh. Okay. Are these the strong currents I need to be wary of? Why do I feel like they're only going to get worse? Audio is good. Okay. 525 meters to town. Jeez. Okay. Um, right. Inventory. I don't need to worry about that. Mission logs. Ooh. Dried squid. Okay. Oh, right, uh, I see. Uh, I, I don't quite see. There's a lot of reading and I can't be bothered. Um, so some populations dying off. Around 2103. But the anglerfish, no data. So, that's, uh, reassuring. Right, am I meant to be going out this way, or... or what? Yeesh. Oh, hang on. I see it. Oh, God. I don't know what I did. Broke something. Um. Any other levers lying around? Oh, hello. I'll stick my arm in this just on the off chance that it might help clear up the vision. But I think I am at full health. I think it's just for how murky and horrible it is down here. Yeah. Right, where do I find the lights? Do I follow the cable? I see lights. I don't like it down here. It's very uh, unfriendly. In just the atmosphere and the. the no. Oh god! Those are the fucking anglerfish! Ow! Ah! Fuck! Just, just keep moving, Simon. Keep moving. Keep it going. Keep it going. Just keep moving. Keep moving. Don't look back. Don't look back. Ugh. I don't like this place. 
If I stick to the lights, will they leave me alone? I can hope so. What fucking hell? Okay. I think I'm in the clear. Insufficient power. I see. Well, let me, uh, let me heal up for a sec. Oh, it's a data buffer. Let's go for that first. Tau, can you hear this? Anyone there? This is Tau? Who is this? This is Ian Peterson of Theta calling. I got a team with me, and we're about half a kilometer from Tau. What? How, how did... You came in the climber? Listen. We're having a really hard time with this sector. Heavy turbulence is making it difficult to move forward, and the wildlife you got is absolutely rabid. The storm comes and goes. The instruments show the weather is relatively fair right now. You should move out as soon as possible. Stick to the lights. The critters should leave you alone. All right, you heard the man. We're moving out, people. Tao, keep the doors unlocked. We're coming in. So that must have been from before Ross and Glasser left. Presumably. Ooh. What have we got in there, eh? What are you? What are you? you don't seem to want to work. You're not working either. Okay, back out. Over to the garage. I'm guessing. Aha. Uh -huh. I've got a little robot dude that I need to uh, have drive around for me. Okay. Um. Tell. That's where I want to go. Oh god! Fucking hell. He's he's off in a hurry. Okay, yeah, you said it, mate. He really did. Eesh. I've gotta to stick to your lights. Oh, please don't please don't go out and leave me on my own. I'm not prepared for that. Oh oh god! Oh god, what was that? Please tell me that was just Ross. Because, uh... No, that's not one... Th considering how far beneath the surface of the ocean we are, I do not need fucking ghostly images in the pitch blackness. Oh, fucking sound of the tectonic shifts is not helping things. Oh God! Oh Jesus! Oh shit! Okay. Follow the glow sticks. I think. Yeah. Uh, uh. No, 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 there's something down here, there's something down here, and I don't like it, and I don't want to know what it is. Uh, I don't like it, it looks like there's face huggers all over the walls. Jesus. I don't know which way I'm going to be going, I'm just... Oh, what are these things? Like sea spiders or something. Oh. As if I needed things to make, like, end up being any worse. Oh god! Oh god! Ugh. <laughs> oh. Okay.
Right. Just, yeah, follow these lights. Not the lights of the anglerfish, the cheeky fuckers. I can't see a fucking thing. Just about follow the lights. Ooh. Is it me or those getting more frequent? Uh, uh, there was something there. There was something there. I know it. I fucking saw it out of the corner of my eye. I can't even tell if my flashlight's on or off. It's just that fucking miserable down here. Okay. Okay. Is this... is this Tau? Please say that this is Tau. Hello? Anybody home? Ugh. That was oh, an ordeal. did they go about building this stuff this far down? <laughs> That's my takeaway from all of this. Never been happier to be inside. Let's find the Ark. Yeah. Oh. Deary me, why would the noises? Dive room. think you're dead down here. Some failed evac story circulating at Omicron. Oh, God. Listen, son. We're on an important mission, and we need your help to operate the Omega space gun. When it's done, we can all head back up the plateau. But now we need to get moving. Of course. Head on through to the habitat. We shut off the front section to preserve power. All right. See you soon. Very curious about the timeline of, of everything. Late. Oh, I definitely don't need to worry about. That. Oh, jeez. Is that what color is that? Is that green? I'm not sure I like that. Suit status. HPS number three, active. Tau. One through four, signal lost. One of those is still here. HPS three, is that it? Yeah. J Yoshida. Hmm. Omicron Climber Station in town. Mm. Yeah, we're gonna have company down here. Of course we are. Why wouldn't we? Mm. 
What? What does it mean airlock pressurizing? Service station. What happened? I don't like this door. I shouldn't have opened this, should I? Oh, fuck. Yep. Shouldn't have opened that. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh, Yoshida, I didn't mean to disturb you. I'm really sorry. Oh, fucking hell. and fucking hide somewhere. I can't hide in this. Fuck. I'm, I'm gonna get got, I know it. I can hide in here. This is not a fun place to be. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> you know what? I think I'm gonna wait for him to hobble the fuck off and I'm going to leave this episode off here. So I'll just say thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, check out the playlist on the channel for more Let's Plays on Metal Covers. Give this video a like or a comment, just leave your thoughts. And if you wish to join the ever-growing ranks of the Order of the Shield, subscribe on YouTube, chuck me a follow over on Twitch, or maybe even consider checking out my Patreon and becoming an officer within the ranks. But thank you again for watching this video. And I'll catch you all very, very soon. This is Captain Meat Shield, signing off. Oh. Uh, do you mind? Look, let's... Fuck, fuck's sake. Why? Let's just carefully put you down there.